Yo, what's going on YouTube sniping for Dom fans and all you big, big, sexy supporters out there? My name is Derek. My gamer tag alias is Sniping for Dom. How the hell are you guys doing today? We are in Tennessee. Um, if you haven't seen some of my other food reviews, been doing a lot of food reviews on this channel. Um, Paula Dean is a sit-down restaurant, family style. We're gonna give it a try today. This is in Pigeon Forge, it's at the island, which is a very cool looking uh, area. So pretty excited to try the food out. We got a couple guests with us today. Um, we'll give you guys a, a good score on whether you should blow your money on this. If you're new to the channel, make sure you slap that like button, hit that subscribe button. It's a pretty, pretty crappy day here in Tennessee. Um, but if you've never been here, Pigeon Forge in Gatlinburg is definitely a little bit more touristy, but it's beautiful uh, to see for sure. Um, I'll show you guys the right outside of Paula Deen's what it looks like. Got Old Smokey over there first. Well, at nighttime, this place looks really, really fucking sweet. We got the dancing water out here with live music most of the time. This is what Paula's looks like right here in the front. Been appreciating everybody showing love on these food reviews. Big shout out to my Twitch community. We're coming up on 98 thousand followers you guys are insane it's twitch.tv forward slash sniping for dom they're parking the car right now we're gonna get in here and we're gonna get some fucking grub and then we're gonna go do an escape room you guys won't see that part uh but if you do follow my social medias you'll be able to see those first so here's the menu and if you don't understand what's going on it might make a little bit more sense if you've never been to one um how it's a sit-down family turntable style so you pick your you get, you get choices you either pick two and then four sides or pick three main courses and then four sides but you pick any from this and then they just bring it out to you if you want more you just ask for it um but you guys will it's a pretty cool concept and it's good food like very good home cooked food definitely worth the price Last time I was here, I've only tried it one time. I think it might have been like $22 a person. But, and you get dessert on top of that, you're not gonna come out of here full at all. We got set down. Luckily, we came early and it wasn't so busy. In the summertime, it's gonna be stacked busy. These are the biscuits. Did you try it yet, Meg? Yeah, it's Super really good. good. <laughs> Jason, bite it now. Yeah, cool enough. Jason, bite it. Put it in. <laughs> yes. It's really good. For a roll? <laughs> oh, Paula. <laughs> all right, so the food came quick. Got all the dishes right here. And whenever you run out, you just simply ask that you want more. That's it. And then they'll bring them out. And we'll let you guys know how it tastes. First bite going in. I love broccoli casserole. It's like one of my favorite things ever. Um, yeah, half a piece, please. Thank you. Thank you. It is review time. Um, it's still pretty good. I've only had this one other time. It's still very, very good. A couple of the things tasted a little bit different. I highly doubt they changed recipes. It may have just been cooks or something like that. Um, I think my favorite part, maybe the greens. The greens are phenomenal. Um, the meats were good. Very ketchup based meats. Uh, the ribs were cooked perfectly. It was great. So I'd say overall experience, I'd say for the atmosphere and to try it once, 
I would go 8.1. Did you like your food? Yeah. On a scale of 10, what is it? By the way, the biscuits can get a 9.6, hard 9.6. Well, it's split. So I think the part I didn't like was like five, and the part I did like was like an eight. All right, it's fair. Jason? Go 7.7. .7. Yeah. Meg? I would give it a six out of 10. What was your favorite part? The greens and the meat ones. The meatloaf was pretty decent. Yeah, the dumplings were really good. Oh, yeah. Yeah, talk about the dumplings. oh yeah, the yeah, yeah. I only had a few. Of the, yeah, the dumplings were pretty the decent. Cat the cat had biscuits. <laughs> um, so definitely come in, check it out, give it a go. It's worth the experience to try at least once. Um, still good. If you like home style cooking, this is the place to come down here that's more commercialized. I'll see you guys on the next food review. Thanks for checking in. Leave a comment down below asking anything. I always reply back to people. Okay, so I'll give you a little visual of the shop inside. It's a pretty decent sized building. We'll do a quick run through here so you can see like there's some stuff for like the, the biscuits and the sauces and all that stuff. 